Welcome to the Folktale Project. This is Dan Shells. This week is a bit of, well, a birthday present to my mother. Her birthday was last Friday, and she's always asking me why I don't do more Italian stories. So this week is all about Italy and Italian tales. Our first story is one of my favorite kinds of stories, because somebody who thinks they know better is getting their comeuppance, and that's that's always a good read. This is The Doctor's Apprentice. Once upon a time, there was a doctor who took his apprentice with him when he made his visits. One day, while visiting a patient, the doctor said, Why do you not listen to my orders that you are not to eat anything? The invalid said, Sir, I assure you that I have eaten nothing. That is not true, answered the doctor, for I have found your pulse beating like that of a person who has eaten grapes. The patient, convicted, said, It is true that I have eaten some grapes, but it was only a little bunch. Very well. Do not risk eating again, and don't think you can fool me. The poor apprentice who was with the doctor was amazed to see how his master guessed from the pulse that his patient had eaten grapes. And as soon as they had left the house, he asked, Master, how did you perceive that he had eaten grapes? Listen, said the doctor. A person who visits the sick must never pass for a fool. As soon as you enter, cast your eyes on the bed and under the bed too, and from the crumbs that you see, you can guess what the patient has eaten. I saw the stalk of the grapes, and from that I infer that he had eaten grapes. The next day, there were many patients in the town, and the doctor, not being able to visit them all, sent his apprentice to visit a few. Among others, the apprentice went to see the man who had eaten the grapes, and wishing to play the part of an expert like his master, to show that he was a skillful physician, when he perceived that there were bits of straw under the bed, said angrily, Will you not understand that you must not eat? The invalid said, I assure you that I have not even tasted a drop of water. Yes, sir, you have, answered the apprentice. You have been eating straw, for I see the bits under the bed. The sick man replied at once, Do you take me for an ass like yourself? And so the apprentice cut the figure of the fool that he was. And that is The Doctor's Apprentice from Italian Popular Tales. And... Again, I really like this story. I I love all of these tales this week. They're short, they're sweet, and they've got a bit of a punch to them. This one in particular because, well, I just, the sick man's answer is just so perfect. You, You know that it's perfect. And it doesn't get better than a, a reply like that. This is Dan Schultz for the Folktale Project. Don't forget that you can subscribe to the podcast on Apple Podcasts, Stitcher, Google Play, Overcast, anywhere you like to get your podcasts. You can follow us on Twitter at Folktale Project. You can find us on Auto Radio, TuneIn Radio, iHeart Radio, Spotify, anywhere you'd like to listen. And you can always head over to folktaleproject.com where you'll find a new story every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Don't forget that if you'd like to help support the podcast, you can head over to folktaleproject.com slash support, where you'll find, well, ways to help support the Folktale Project. As always, thank you so much for listening. <laughs> <laughs>